In Redcar and Cleveland alone, there are almost 12,000 households who rent privately for their home. Almost 50% of those households are in receipt of housing benefit to help pay their rent. And unfortunately, the less money you have as a private tenant, the less choice you have. Well, I was actually, I had no fixed abroad at the time because my mum did a mum like shit on me. And I was like living at different people's houses and obviously I was pregnant. And then I just seen this sign out the front of the flat and then, well, I emailed you. We make sure that all of our tenants can afford the rent and the bills of the properties before we put them in. And then through our management services, we make sure that tenants have got any advice and support that they need to make sure they sustain their tenancy. We did have a bit of problems at first with the backdating of the rent and everything like that, but you were really understanding and, and patient with it. So. A lot of people, I think, would have kicked me out. Just because you're renting shouldn't exclude you from feeling that when you close that door, it's your home and that's what's important to you. Just that if I ring up they're here, if I need them, if I need anything, or if I had a problem with rent, it was going to be a day late, I'd just ring up and explain, and they're quite happy with it. I, I don't suppose I'd go anywhere else, because up to now I'd have the service from them. In a nutshell, we're buying properties to provide decent and affordable homes to rent. All of the properties that will be owned or bought and owned by the new company will be let and managed through the Ethical Lettings Agency and we're talking about a long-term investment, so circa 20 years. Being able to buy and own our own properties means that we'll be able to house so many more people than what we can just by letting and managing third-party landlord properties. And it also means that we can target some of the areas where we know that there's real demand and need for decent and affordable rented housing, but we just don't have access into those areas at the moment. Our vision is to fix the broken housing market. It's not worked for decades in this country and too many people have really poor choices of where to particularly rent their home. If we can change that here and then change it around the country, that's what we're aiming to do.